Hey guys, it's Kimberly here with TV Stuff Reviews. Today we are going to be reviewing the Egg Pod. Apparently with the Egg Pod, you can make hard boiled eggs in the microwave, so we're gonna test that out. Let's get started. Before we get started, make sure to like this video and hit the subscribe button and even the little bell notification so that way you'll get notified of when we review a new TV product. Okay, so we have our egg pod here and we have some eggs to test this out. So let's get out the egg pod. I've already opened up the box, but I have not opened up the egg pod. And this is what it looks like. Okay, so the first step is to unlock and open the egg pod, pull the tabs down. Okay, step number two is measure 50 milliliters of water using the provided measuring cup and fill the bottom of egg pod with water. So I got this, but it says with the provided measuring cup, which makes me think that there is actually a measuring cup for this. And there is. <laughs> That's really nifty actually. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash this out before I use it. Okay, so here is 50 milliliters of water. So now we're done with that. So now we have to put four eggs here. As you can see, there are four places to put the eggs. So you can make up to four eggs. Wow. <laughs> All right. One, two, three, and four. Without cracking them, that's great. Um, make sure the lid is properly aligned with the base of the egg pod and pull the tabs up to lock. So let's put this bad boy back on here and pull the tabs back up. Step number five. Place the unit into the microwave and cook for nine minutes at a high at a highest setting. Cooking times may vary, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so we're gonna throw this in here for up to nine minutes at the highest setting that this microwave has, and we will get back to you. All right. Nine minutes. Okay, in nine minutes, I should have perfectly hard boiled eggs. We'll see if this thing works. Okay, so there are 30 seconds left and I read that you have to wait for it to cool down in the microwave for two minutes or else you could burn your hands. So we're gonna wait for it to cool for two minutes after it's done in the microwave. And there's 10 seconds left. So now we have to wait for two minutes. I can definitely feel that it's hot, but the handles are not very hot, so that's good. And now we have to put it under running cold water for two minutes. So here we go, and the tabs are down. There we go. Okay, these eggs are hot. Be careful that you don't burn yourself on this part because I could definitely see that happening. Um, so now we're gonna run it under cold water for two minutes, which in my opinion is kind of wasteful of water, but... So we're gonna do that for two minutes. <laughs> Okay, so now we're done running the cold water. So now there's water left in here and it's still, and I have to put the top back on, put it over that and, and shake it 10 times. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so here's our egg pod. I put the tabs back on so water won't spill out, and now we have to shake it 10 times so that way the eggs crack. All right, here we go. <laughs> Eight, nine, 10. Okay, let's see what it looks like. Okay, so here are the eggs. They're cracked now. Okay, let's see if it boiled. So the shell comes off really easily, so that's nice. Wow, it worked. <laughs> so wow, the, <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> oh. So the egg is hard. <laughs> My mom got a little excited about this. So the egg is hard boiled here. And uh, ah. so it works. And I really like this a lot because I've always struggled with making hard boiled eggs. I've never gotten the right consistency in the inside. It's always been too runny. This really makes the perfect hard boiled egg. So I would recommend it for people like me that really struggle with making hard boiled eggs. But for people that are really economical and don't want to use a microwave for nine minutes or you have running water happening for two minutes, it may not be the right option for you, but for people like me, I would really recommend it, especially for people that are on the go. So that's my review. I was really impressed that it actually worked. I doubted that it would work, but it did. So overall, I would give this product a five out of five. The ease of using this product was incredible and I, it really helped my boiled egg struggle that I've had before. So I'm definitely going to be using it again if you enjoyed this video, remember again to hit the subscribe button so that way you'll see new TV product reviews. See you next time.